let's take a look at this problem. We got 4x minus y is equal to 11 and 2x plus 3y is equal to 9. And we want to solve this. It says use Kramer's rule, but that's I'm doing it by hand. We're going to use a calculator to do this in this video. Um, once I get time, then I'll do this in a separate video by hand, so you can see that if you're curious. Um, we're going to use REF. And so we're going to put the x's in one column, the y's in one column, and number on the other side of the equals in one column. So we're going to have 4, negative 1, 11. We'll have 2, 3, 9. Now our size of our matrix rows by columns. This is a 2 by 3. So let's go ahead and put this in. So I'll do second x and negative 1 to go into the matrix menu. Left arrow over to edit. Enter on A. It's 2 by 3, so do 2 enter, 3 enter. And we got 4 enter, negative 1 enter, 11 enter, 2 enter, 3 enter, 9 enter. 2, 3, 9, 4, negative 1, 11. Okay, so I'll exit out, so do second mode. Now I'll go through my REF. So do second x and negative 1, right arrow to math, up arrow to REF. Make sure you choose one of two R's. Press enter. Go back to my matrix menu, second x negative 1, enter on A, enter again. Okay, and we get 1, 0, 0, 1, 3, 1. Two variables, two equations. So our first 2 by 2 um, square here has to be a diagonal 1, 0, 0, or else. And it is. So this is our x and this is our y. So our answer will be 3, 1. Now if you're wondering why in that order, well, see how we put x first and y second here? So this will be x, y. So whatever order our variables are in and the columns over here is the order of our answers.